Spurgs, we have a pretty tight kitchen for the capacity of venue we have. I mean, being able to produce food at a two hat level in, in that environment by sourcing incredible produce and then letting that do a lot of the hard work and treating it with respect. There are techniques and a lot of a lot of different things we do to, to keep original and to keep challenging ourselves. But I think the where we have a big difference to everyone else is that we spend so much time sourcing every single ingredient, whether it's the salt, olive oil, the vegetables, the meat, every, everything has a reason. And I say it to my apprentices all the time, everything is everything, everything matters. Whether it's the way, whether it's when a tomato is being watered before you pick it, whether it's the type of salt you use, Every tiny thing that you think doesn't matter, even the temperature of a plate, has so much effect on the end product that if you, if you care about every single small step along the way, everything comes together and is, is amazing. I suppose being in such an iconic location, not just in, in Australia, but wor worldwide, people, people look at icebergs and go, it's, it's such an incredible Australian restaurant. But I think the biggest thing that Morris has given us a lot of freedom with that most Italian places don't is being strictly Australian with our sourcing of ingredients. And it's, it's an incredible thing to know that you can cook food that tastes so deeply Italian with nothing but local produce. It, it's what inspires everything for us. Some of the best memories I've ever had with food is simply just eating the best version of something I've ever eaten. Like you can pinpoint so many times in, in your head when you've eaten the best version of a single ingredient you ever have. It's, it's, it's really special and you, you almost, you never forget that flavor and you never forget when it was or why it tasted that way and you constantly chase it. I mean, you can buy a strawberry from any major supermarket and they can sit on the shelf for, for weeks and they just taste like sour water basically. But if you buy a strawberry that's been grown with care organically, hasn't been pumped full of water, and it's not a strawberry that's made to last, it's a strawberry that's made to taste. I don't care about being able to sit on something for two weeks without it going bad. I care about doing the best possible version of this I can. It makes such a difference. So you're having a dinner party at home, if you spend time going to a farmer's market or something like that, sourcing produce that already tastes incredible, rather than spending six hours doing some insane recipe from a cookbook that will never actually be exactly the same as it is in a restaurant, if you spend that time sourcing those ingredients, it does all the hard work for you so that when you're actually around your friends or your family or your loved ones, you don't, you're not spending that time focusing, reading a recipe book, you know, trying to follow everything to a T and stressing about it you're spending more time making memories with the ones you love rather than trying to turn an average ingredient into an amazing dish. If you start with an amazing ingredient, then you don't need to do much else to it. <laughs> you know?